One month has gone, but the full force of Typhoon Haiyan is far from forgotten. In Takloban, tens of thousands of people are still living without shelter. If you've got anything that resembles a house, then you're lucky. Zyrene Tomada lives here with her one-year-old son, Clyde. Everything is destroyed, our, our home, and we lost our aunt. That's why it's very hard. But the city is slowly cleaning up. Thousands have signed up for cash for work programs. Aid agencies trying to put money in people's pockets, paying them a few dollars a day to shift the mountains of debris. A month ago, people were scavenging for food. But today, the main market is busy, although prices are twice as high as before the typhoon. We can survive this through prayers. You can fight for your, your, your business. One month on, Tacloban is slowly getting back on its feet. Hundreds of millions have now been pledged in foreign aid. But the scale of what's needed means rebuilding is going to take years, not months. Day of prayer and remembrance. Takloban is remembering the dead, but also offering prayers for the living. One month on, this city still has a long, long way to go. John Donison, BBC News, Takloban.